Welcome back to my channel. Today's video, we are doing a Boston Market mukbang. I took it to go. Um, I actually went there 30 minutes before they closed, so it was like a last minute type thing. But that's what we're having tonight. Uh, anyways, before we get started, I do want to thank you guys for subscribing to my channel. If you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Turn on your notification bell so you'll be notified when a video is uploaded. Don't forget to like and comment down below. And don't forget to share this video with everybody baddies. I'm so excited. So today's video, I'm just chatting a little bit with you guys and having a little dinner. I had a late long day and I just wanted to sit down and talk to you guys. So I am very disappointed, I'll tell you that much. I asked for dark meat and this is what they gave me. That's a little piece of meat. What am I supposed to do with that? What? And then I got the garlic herb, but it just looks oily. I got some mac and cheese and sweet potato casserole. And I thought they would have had a little salt and pepper in here, but they don't. And then I have the cornbread muffin. I don't really like cornbread. I'm going to just throw that in there and eat because I'm hungry. And then I'm drinking uh, just a Coke. So I changed the background setting for you guys a little bit. That's my Christmas wall in the background. Changed it up a little bit so you guys can see that um, for the next couple of mukbangs. I'll have that in the background. Um, I do want to thank you guys for checking out my Vlogmas vlogs. I've been, um, this is my first year doing it, so I'm new to it. So I've been basically trying to vlog, you know, everything that I've been out doing, getting ready, prepared for Christmas. Um, and just everyday life, you know, since my channel is based on my everyday life. I am hungry. Um, uh, it's late. I was doing hair for an old friend of mine, her daughter. I love her to death. Fell in love with her today. Did her hair. Everything worked out good. I'm hungry. She mentioned that she was going to stop at Boston Market on her way home. So I figured, hey, let me run and go get something to eat too so I can sit down and talk. But here it is. I'm going to do a mug. Try to do a thumbnail, y'all. Whatever. Let's dig in because I am hungry. I'm going to have to get up and get some salt and pepper. Mm. It's just something about the sweet potato souffle thing that they make. It just tastes so fluffy and creamy. And I love it. I always get it. I need some salt and pepper for my macaroni, though. I'll tell you that right now. I know I am. On my shirt, y'all already know my food always end up on my shirt. It ain't me eating if my food ain't on my shirt. For real. So, how you guys doing? How has everybody been? How's everybody? I didn't want to talk with my mouth full. My bad. How has everybody been feeling about Christmas? Are y'all in Christmas spirit? What's up? How y'all feeling? I just started getting into the spirit. Um, The first through the, I want to say fourth or fifth, I wasn't really feeling it, but I guess I'm getting into it now, or oh, whatever. Going out, seeing everybody shopping and stuff, for me out vlogging and then candle day, so I guess that kind of put me in a little mood. I swear this chicken is so small. It's like they gave me nothing. So I just wanted to talk to y'all about, you know, how I've been feeling about this YouTube journey I've decided to take. Like, honestly, I don't think any YouTubers beginning startup ever went as fast as they wanted it to go. So for me, I feel like at the pace my channel is going, it's going fairly well. It's not going bad. I don't think it is. I mean, I only have a couple of videos that got over like 100, 200 something views as tops. And that's not much compared to these big time YouTubers at all. But for me, I feel like it's a lot. I feel like it's huge. I am at 120 subscribers. I feel like that is huge. Like my channel, I've only had my channel since mid-October. 
So I feel like I'm doing really well with that. And I feel like I'm moving at a decent pace. So for me, I just decided to literally take a leap of faith and decided that I didn't want to go back to work and that I wanted to pursue YouTube because I've always wanted to be on camera. And I feel like with YouTube, you can be on camera on your terms. You're not being directed by a director. You're not acting. You're being yourself on camera. So that's something I've always wanted to do. And honestly, it did take some time to get where I am now with uploading videos constantly. But in the beginning, when I first wanted to do a YouTube channel, it was years ago. And I researched, printed out papers, read about it, watched videos about it, but never really did it. This time around, when I, when I actually was like, you know what, I'm doing this, I took a couple of classes. I took a class a couple of times. Um... I started doing more in-depth research. I started applying and I just went for it. I just said, you know what? I'm uploading today. Uh -uh, today. And when I did that, ever since that, I just upload every day. Now, I'm not going to lie. I do have a couple of gaps in my uploads to where I didn't upload for like two or three days. Honestly, guys, those within those um days where I didn't upload, where there was like a two or three day gap between my videos, I was depressed honestly depressed lost confused like what are you doing you got bills to pay this that, and the third and i just be praying to god like oh god you're gonna make a way god it's gonna it's gonna be all right i'm gonna get through it you're gonna make a way i gotta just pray to god and that's just what i've been doing and i've been maintaining i've been getting by and just not letting it really affect me from being consistent. Like I have to stay consistent if I want to be successful. So that's what I'm just basically doing. Like consistent. But yeah, so that taking that leap, the leap of faith and just going for it and just doing it. I mean, yeah, I still have to have my bills paid. So I do have to work. Um, I have a job where I do have to work. I just don't have to work for a company. I do have my own business. And it has its slow peaks. And I feel like I'm in a slow peak right now. And it's kind of trying because I'm facing these challenges with my bills because my business is not at a peak right now. So, um, I'm just taking it all at once and just going with the flow and just staying consistent and i just really 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 wanted to come on here and tell you guys how much i appreciate all of the support um i'm telling you guys we got so much big stuff coming like and when i mean big stuff i mean like things that i feel like are going to help us grow um videos that i want to put out that i feel like are going to attract attention um like i have videos plant coming up like especially christmas day is so important because i'm going to be filming us feeding the homeless people in our city which we've done for 15 years it's a tradition in our family so now that i'm in youtube i get to share that with you guys like it's just a lot and i'm just excited to share everything and just gain more baddies and relationships with you guys and just you got really let people into my life like the life of Jay Red. <laughs> I'm a Sagittarius. And we still is Sagittarius season. All my Sag Sag babies turn up. I didn't even go put salt and pepper on this. I'm hungry. I don't even care at this point. And honestly, it's watery today. And this mac and cheese is a no. I'm already mad about how y'all jeep me on my chicken. I got watery mac and cheese. But the souffle, sweet potato souffle on point. I don't eat that cornbread, but I got to sit and soaking up this garlic, herb, butter stuff at the bottom. And I'm eating it today. I'm hungry. <laughs> yep, I'm hungry. So I just wanted to step in. I'm almost done eating, y'all. 
I just want to step in and just really tell y'all I appreciate you guys. Thanks for watching this video. Please comment down below what you guys think and how you guys feel about YouTube um, starting YouTube beginners and their struggles. How do you guys cope with it? How do you guys um, encourage me to keep moving forward? Comment down below your answers. Thank you for watching this video, guys. Thank you, thank you so much. Don't forget to like it. I was thinking about that, you guys, too, because I wanted to come up with something that was catchy for liking my videos. Let me know down in the comments below if you like this. But I wanted to come up with um, something where I'm like, don't go ahead and like it and like it. Don't forget to like it and like it. Something like that, y'all. Like it and like it, like it, or I don't know. But I got to come up with something, y'all. Y'all need to help me. Anyways, thank you so much, baddies. Until next time, I'll see you on the next video.